to do to do my intro and so I deleted the clip and I'm like why is hubby on my why you play so much Good morning happy Friday today we are off we're about to try something new and I'm so excited I got this ain't yeah I was being extra there we're going to try hot Pilates today. It is 8.55. I got, made us some smoothies last night. Took out my clothes last night, but I need to go ahead and get ready. Babe, are you ready? Ooh, okay, I forgot to put deodorant on. Nervous and excited at the same time. We usually, when we are off, we usually do something either hiking breakfast in the morning going out for breakfast or um what else have we done oh i don't remember what holiday that was i think it was probably like two months ago we went to the spa it's just i just don't record it you know we just spending time together without recording so this time around i said let me go ahead and record what we're doing today and i know i don't have no lashes on i got two little legs right here and the nails looking real real and I was talking all that mess. Hold on, y'all. I know. I was talking all that mess, how I can walk around with these, but I've been so busy. So hopefully we'll get this done today, eyebrows done today. So we're going to be very productive instead of staying home doing nothing. Well, I could clean up, but y'all know. So let's get ready to go to Hot Pilates. Oh, Lord, I forgot to introduce myself. Whew. I'm just too excited. Hey Slay Babes. Welcome back to another vlog. If you're new here, hi, my name is Fab. Welcome, welcome, welcome. And I already said what today was. When I get this two pack, can't tell me nothing, nothing, nothing. on my face I know that works out for me glowy skin The camera fell. 
mm. okay where's my okay so this was something new we tried i don't mind trying something new it depends what it is okay mm -hmm. it really depends because if it's something dealing with heights i know i'm not gonna do it at all you want to try this sure what is this she said um it is um power balls with m&ms does this look like a ball to you? <laughs> it looks like a chip i know got our smoothies hubby didn't like the um, Mm, the protein shakes. So I made his with coconut um, water, and I made mine, of course, with milk. Thank you. I I don't want to chew and talk right now. That's why I was not trying to eat it. Hold on. So we went to Hotworks, and I recorded on my my phone because my camera trying to adjust everything at this time was not it. So the class started at 9:45. We was greeted by. So young ladies that she got right here walking. Really, really nice people. Riley and Ashley. Riley and Ashley in Marietta, if you in Georgia. The class was about 30 minutes. 30 minutes long, right? Was it about 30 minutes? Yeah. Yeah, about 30 minutes. 30 minutes long. They do provide you. She went over everything before we even went into the sauna. And it only could fit two people in that sauna, which is pretty good. Then nobody else is in there with you <laughs> watching me struggle because I was struggling in there. They provide you a mat, a towel, and what else did we have in there? You and, had your foam roller. Oh yeah, the foam roller, the hat, of oh, the hat, the foam <laughs> roller, the mat, and a towel. You could adjust the temperature as well. I don't think we even did that. I think the lady um, did it for us. Yeah. And it's actually the instructor is on a TV screen. And what else? So they kind of set up the class for you. However, you go in there. There's a giant, mm -hmm. there's a giant screen on there that lets you know, like, hey, look, these are the classes that they got going on. Um, no, but when you called, they told you the class starts at 9:45. Yeah, so, so there's different classes on that screen that start at 9:45. Yeah. Oh, okay. So the one that we end up picking was the Pilates. They had like a yoga, the Pilates, some kind of core. So we did Pilates. They set it for you. Go in there. Mm -hmm. When we got in there, it was like 118 degrees. 118 degrees. Oh, yeah. You leave all your stuff outside. You go in barefoot. Barefoot. Uh, with yeah, your I forgot water. to say that part. Um, and then you just start the class. Yeah. I've never done Pilates in my life. I've never done it. I always said I wanted yes. to try Pilates. So I'm a type of person, I have to look up what I sign up for. Just like when I'm going to a new restaurant, sometimes I look up the menu just in case there's something, you know, there's, I can't eat anything in that, um, on that menu. So I was on TikTok yesterday, you know, TikTok has everything for you. Like <laughs> you go to TikTok for everything. And I was looking it up. I was like, okay, it says it's 24 hours. You got to put a code in. Um, only two to three people could fit in there, which is not three people could fit in that one. Um... There's different classes. So I already, I already knew what I signed up for. So I was happy, happy, happy that we did it. It was always struggling, but I made it work. <laughs> I can't eat me. I can't stretch. I can't I'm stretch. Not I'm not that flexible. <laughs> Don't get it twisted, y'all. Don't get it twisted. <laughs> okay, what twisted? What, what you flexible at doing, baby? Tell me. Let me know. Nah, we gonna keep it PG, honey. We'll keep it PG. She's PG. I'm rated MA. Yes, you are. Yes, you are. Hello, Powerball was pretty, pretty good. I like she it. She liked it. I did. I like it. I like peanut butter ish type of ooh, smoothies. I used to eat peanut butter sandwiches all the time. Gross. Back in the days when I was in my 20s. Now I can't keep doing that. Because <laughs> I actually got some money to eat some real food. <laughs> now you eat gourmet sandwiches. <laughs> no. Oh, my 20s. That was that poor man diet. I didn't make it work. But no. <laughs> I can't eat no bread like that. Oh, well, that's what it is. Mm -hmm. So... You see me? About to get my eyebrows done. I don't know what we're going to eat. I don't know what we're going to do, but we're going to go with the flow because today is Friday. 
It's going to be a good. Oh, sorry. We're going to Marietta Fool Hall. And it's going to be a good day. Is the grilled cheese? Oh, barely, barely be eating any calories. <laughs> this thing is tiny, which is fine, but I got the lobster grilled cheese. That probably can't hear me because of the music in the background, but I'll tell y'all later. What is that anyway? Uh, Dogi. Oh, okay. They got kimchi, radish, ginger. Chicken, sushi rice, sesame seeds, corn, all kind of onions, pineapple, Looks good. bogey chicken. I got some kind of fish eggs right here. Mm. It's good, like a mess though, but that's okay. What do you think about my eyebrows? They look good. I always have to tell her, you know, I need them to match because this one is more arch, and I always say this every time I get on you. I always say that. They put my glasses on. <laughs> what, babe? It's raining. Such a horrible day. Look, I got skills, y'all. I can do it with one hand, though. I just. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, gosh. Babe. I'm trying to kill us out here. The lady. She's snitching again. I know, right? Y'all know I stay snitching. That lady was like, your lashes, ma'am. Don't worry about these lashes. Don't worry about them. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it, sweetheart. Don't worry about it. You know that? Um, like, Can I take it off for you? <laughs> I was like, I know, I know. She Looking rough. Read that thing. No, what? She was like, your upper, your upper lip. No, no, thank you. I know I have a mustache, but I always <laughs> shave it at home. I always shave it at home. So, <laughs> so um, in this plaza, there's this Renaissance Center. That's not making me look good? Making me look good. That I, okay, whatever, it's okay. I ain't worried about that. So in this plaza, like I was trying to say. Mustache. <laughs> um, there's a Rena Center. That took me back. That didn't take you back? I don't know about you. But that took me back. The struggles back in the days. Oh, that's why I appreciate everything I have right now. Okay. Cause now I can buy cash. <laughs> I appreciate. Oh my God, that's why I walk to my own beat. I don't try to be like nobody. I don't try to act like I got what I don't have. Cause there's people out there that do that. I just appreciate. Living up to the Joneses. Yeah, I just appreciate what I basically what I have. My family, my job that I always complain about, but I came so far. I'm still gonna complain about it because no, I just don't no, like Birkin. No. Okay, 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 okay. Thank we take God. it back. Woo! Thank God. Babe, Not this was not God. on the list to do to go to no Sam's Club. This was not. What do you on mean? You took you wrote the whole list almost. I, I know, but I have other things to do. See, I need some more friends. And we're gonna talk about friendship later since Hubby just parked. And it you is need more friends. This, no. This, this is Bad advice, okay? Bad advice. You need oh, two or three solid friends. Can you change the time on my arm? Yeah, when we go. Okay. All right, y'all. I'll, I'll see you all. I later. don't need friends, trust me. We'll, we'll talk about no. Solid core. No, no, I want to talk about friendship, what I read. So I will share with that with you all. Y'all see me? <laughs> these ugly nails. And why? My lady was like, your nails look good. Where? 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 It doesn't look good. It does not look good at all. At all. You gotta take your small wins, babe. The I cut them all messed up and everything, babe. Let's okay. We're not gonna be Listen. here for two, three hours because y'all already know he likes to be in his grocery store for hours. Okay. Grocery store. Sam's is what? What kind of store is that? It's a wholesale store. <laughs> Semantics. Kill. Two hundred for what? You know I'm always gonna complain about the price. <laughs> you want everything free. I want everything free.
And this one comes with, um, with yeah, with the pan and everything. So this would be good for my rum cake. I'm only making one. Yeah. This is good. And it's only... Well, it's $20. That's not too bad. Jesus. Zero. Is that... Straight zero. All right, let me zoom in. Can y'all see that? Let me show y'all why. Hazardous, hazardous. We're gonna have to talk about this another time. Jeez. Okay, so that's not good. Severe irritation. Dove is not good as well. What was Dove? He got this album now. He's just so happy about it. <laughs> so yeah, the Yuka app right here. Mm -hmm. If y'all haven't seen it, so it. The wifey would throw up a little picture in the description for y'all. <laughs> Try and scan it so we could go. Oh, yeah. This has probably been the best health care, body care that we've scanned with whatever. No mm -hmm. sulfates, no dyes, no parabens. I mean, literally everything we've scanned with this. But this one is a 72. It says it's good for you. With our harmful silicone sulfates, the whole nine. Yeah. We even the conditioner is even better. Yeah, the conditioner is so good. Get, get that thing all, all silky smooth. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. You know, you guys would truly, truly appreciate it. It's already it. over. And turn your notification on so, so you miss out on your girl. No, it's not over. I'm just I didn't say this part yet. Can okay. we go? Yo, y'all tap in, tap in. Roll to a thousand K. <laughs> that ain't make sense. One K. We've been out all day since nine o'clock. We picked up London from school, and we're supposed to be going to happy hour. Happy hour finished at seven o'clock, and it is six thirty. So if we decide to go to happy hour, that's not happening. This is gonna be a late dinner. I didn't know we was gonna do all that running around. I thought we was gonna go to Hot Works and get something to eat. Of course, pick up London, get her situated, because you know, of course, we gotta get her situated and then, you know, go out. But I didn't know we was doing all that, you know? I thought today was going to be a day, just me, him, just spending time together. Besides, you know, most of the time you all see us either, you know, we have our date nights and running errands, but I didn't want to run no errands. Even so, Thanksgiving is coming up in like two weeks. I could not say that for some reason. In two weeks and you know, we getting things, <laughs> buying things. We still didn't go to the grocery store to buy food yet. We bought a few things. We may have to go tomorrow. I don't know, probably not tomorrow because London has volleyball practice. We're probably gonna have to go Sunday or maybe during the week. <sighs> That's probably going to be the plan. I didn't want to add today to tomorrow vlog. So this vlog probably gonna be up on Sunday because I didn't want to make it, you know, 40 minutes long or 50 minutes long of, you know, us running errands and all that. So I said, let me go ahead and record today. The lady at the gym, she um, texts me and asks me, do I want to come back for another free session? So I'm really thinking about joining the gym. It's only $60, but just for that location. And it's 24 hours. I think I did say that. They do have a like a keypad at the door. So, you know, you come in and out. If you do bring a guest, I think it's an extra $30. Hubby said he doesn't want to join because, he, you know, he goes to jiu-jitsu. And I do have a membership at a gym. But they keep changing management and the gym name. And I don't know if I still want to go there. I do want to start, you know, lifting weights. Since I lost a little weight, a little weight, I do want to, you know, tone up my stomach, and my butt, my legs, you know, all that. So I may want to join that gym, probably do it like once or twice. So I may go again for another free session and see, I'm gonna try another class because I think they offer yoga. I'm not a fan of yoga. I think spin class, I may do the spin class. I think it's short and they do have weights and stuff over there. I'm not too sure. I'll, I'll, I'll give you guys an update about that. Oh, Y'all already know. I'm gonna include it. Babe, you ready? 
I know this man didn't go downstairs without me. Hold on, y'all. Oh, that man went downstairs. <laughs> that man went downstairs. Anyway, so another thing too, that lobster grilled cheese. Y'all already know Monday through Friday, I kind of eat, you know, healthy. And it wasn't on a white bread before y'all be like, oh, she was eating on white. No, it was not on a white bread. It was on um, Texas toast. And I was like, do I really want to eat that? But you know, sometimes I do. When I go out to eat, I do eat. You know what I mean? I don't eat too healthy. I, you know, I'm going to eat because other days I'm not eating as much. It was, it was okay. And it was small too. Okay. So I didn't feel too guilty. So y'all better not make me feel guilty about that. Okay. It was, it was all right. It was all right. I like the one in Lenox better and the one place we went to, what was it? Steamy's? We went to on my birthday. That one was really good. It was a lot of lobster in there. This one was, it was acting a little cheap with it. I think it was about $17. I already know everything is expensive nowadays. Everything's expensive. Everything. So I think hubby is waiting for me downstairs, y'all. I think he is. But I want to share one more thing and then we're going to go. I'm going to, after that, I'm going to end the vlog and start a new one tomorrow for the weekend. So this one probably going to be up on Sunday. And I don't know how often I'm going to do two vlogs per week. Well, we'll see y'all. We'll see. We will we, we'll see. I'm going to try to figure that part out. But I know I wanted to share what we do today with you all. And worry about tomorrow because I got a few things tomorrow. I still didn't get take these nails off. I got to get a pedicure as well because hubby wants me to go to a birthday party. And my toenail chap and I'm sh not going to wear no shoes like that. Nah. No, I don't believe in that. That I am not about to do. No. So anyway, this is what I wanted to share when it comes to friendship. And when I read this, and I got it from the Bible app I was showing you all. That's probably hubby texting me. <laughs> like what he said, downstairs waiting on you. Oh my gosh, babe. Uh, let me let me read this to you all. I'm not trying to make this long, but it says here, um, when was the last time you messaged a friend to see how they're doing just because you were thinking of them? When was the last time you offered a friend help even though it was inconvenient for you? It says here, the act of loving at all times does not imply that we should ignore sin or abuse from others. That's not what Jesus, Jesus did. It is still necessary to hold people accountable for their actions and for the consequences that follow. You know, a lot of people don't take accountability nowadays. They really, really, really don't. And when I read that, I was like, oh my God, I was talking about this maybe a while back in my vlog. How I was saying, you know, I'm from Miami and we moved when hubby got hired with his job. We moved to Arizona. We moved here in Georgia. So I was, you know, and this is nothing, I, it's no hard feelings against anyone that I know from back in the days or anything like that. No love loss or anything like that, you know? Um, you know, I used to hit, you know, certain people up. Hey, how you doing? You know, some will respond, some will not. You know, it's out of sight, out of mind type of situation, which is fine. I'm not like that. I will check on people. But now I'm at to the point like, and I know that's probably bad and give me all your opinions about that as well. Do you check on people or how's that going for you if you do? I just like, you know, if you, if you're not responding, I'm just going to leave that alone. Like I said, no love laws. And I remember back in the days with my mom, she used to say, um, you know, when you get older, it's hard making friends. And I'm like, that is true. So that is true. I don't need that many friends. When I was in my 20s, I used to hang out with two girls. We used to go to the club and, you know, do everything together. I could trust them. They could trust me. So now that I'm older and, you know, working, family, it's different. Of course, you're not going to hang around people as much, but you just need some, you know, good friends sometimes, you know, to talk to, hang out with, you know, just reliable people. And... It is hard. It is definitely hard, you know? And I'm fine. I'm content. I was just I was just joking. If y'all understand my personality, I'd just be talking ish, okay? I would just talk it ish. I know my husband gonna go with me. He's reliable because nowadays people are not reliable. They'll agree to something and don't want to go for real. Nah, I ain't got time for that. If you don't want to go for real, you can let me know. 
You ain't gonna hurt my feelings. Cause at the end of the day, I'm probably gonna go without you if you ain't gonna wanna go with me. <laughs> or find my husband to go with me. So that's what I wanted to say. Comment down below, how do y'all feel about that as you got, you know, that now that you are older, is it hard for you to make friends? Or not? So let's go, let's go to this happy hour cause hubby is downstairs waiting. But I'll see y'all later. Murder, 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 murder.